Hi guys, so <clears throat> one of the mommies on YouTube did a, I think it's like Haley Lou or something like that, um, she did a pregnancy tag, um, it was kind of like, um, because she's not pregnant anymore either, um, so it's kind of like a pregnancy tag, like, then and now, um, so I thought it'd be fun to do it, like, just to, like, reminisce on, on the pregnancy and stuff, okay, so, <coughs> number one, how and when did you find out you were pregnant? Um, I found out, I believe, June, um, I'm pretty, I'm almost positive it was June, and, um, I found out because, well, I took a pregnancy test because, um, I was late on my period, and my period is, like, like clockwork, um, and, yeah, so I decided I'd take a pregnancy test, and then it was positive, um, and, ah, that's pretty much how that went. Two, how did you feel, um, emotionally and physically? Um, well, emotionally, I was excited but nervous. Oh, goodness, Donna Marie. Oh, my goodness. She's, she's got my hair. Again. Again. Okay. Um, so, yeah, I was nervous, um, excited. Um, physically, I'm not kidding you. After I, I took the pregnancy test, and the day after, I got hit with morning sickness. Like, oh my gosh. It was terrible, horrible. Um, all throughout my pregnancy, I had to take um, medicine that stopped me from throwing up because I could not keep anything down. So, number three, how did you tell your partner? Um, he pretty much knew that, oh, you're fine. <laughs> he pretty much knew that I was taking a pregnancy test. Um, so, pretty much just said it was positive. <laughs> um, let's see. Four, did you wait two months to tell people? I wanted to wait, um, but I just got so excited. I think by nine weeks um, is when I started telling people. Uh, I wanted to wait 12, but I just couldn't do it. I was just so excited. Um, five, is this your first? Yes, this is my first baby girl. Number six, do you want more? Yes, we do want more. Um, we're not sure when we want more, but my husband and I were talking, and we think three will be good. Um, so he wants, of course we want a boy, but we probably not going to get it like this, but, um, we think having another girl would be cool after Donna, and then having a little boy, um, as our last, but who knows, I always wanted four, so we might even have four, we'll see how it goes, um, number seven, biggest craving, Chinese food, I definitely crave Chinese food a lot, like, um, after I got over the, the morning sickness, um, like, well, after I got on the, the medicine, I was able to, as long as I took it right straight in the morning, I was able to, um, keep everything down and had an appetite. What is the best part about being pregnant? Um, definitely being able to feel baby girl, uh, or baby move. Um, that is just, like, one feeling that it's just, like, really hard to describe, and it's just the most amazing feeling ever. Um, and also, like, hearing hearing the heartbeat and seeing them in your belly on the ultrasound. Um, I think that's the best part. Let's see. Nine. Did you find out the gender, and what did you prefer? Um, yes, we found out the gender at 19 weeks. Um, my husband was set on having a girl. He wanted to have a baby girl. I didn't really, my, like, care, like, what we had in the beginning, but then, um, just, like, knowing he wanted a girl made me want to have a girl, too, I guess. Um, let's see. Did you have names picked out? What are the stories behind them? Um, yes, we had names picked out from pretty much, like, very early on. So, um, if it was a boy, we were going to name him, um, 
William James um, and call him Billy James um, because my dad's name was William and he passed away when I was 19. Donna Marie, you're crazy. Um, he passed away when I was 19, so um, that was, you know, I really wanted to name um, our first son after him. And then we decided um, James is Leland's middle name, um, and then uh, William was my dad's first name. Um, and then for the for for girl name for Donna Marie, um, Leland's sister passed away when she was like um, really young, um, not really young, but she she had really young kids, um, and her name was Donna. So we decided to name our baby girl after her and then we took my middle name Marie um, and so now we named her Donna Marie um, let's see what what was your birth plan um, I just knew that from um, from like stories and everything I this was my birth plan I will go in there and I will try and do it natural, but um, if it hurts too bad, <laughs> I'm definitely going to get the epidural. That was my right plan. Um, the, like, the, just the big thing that I, like, really wanted is I, I knew I was going to breastfeed her, so I wanted, um, I wanted her to breastfeed as soon as possible, and they were actually, um, they actually, like, had the same beliefs too, so um, that was kind of just my breast, my 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 birth plan. Um, will you breastfeed? Yes, um, I I do breastfeed. Um, I plan on breastfeeding for a while. It's the best thing. Um, not dogging anybody who formula feeds. Um, I know that there's situations and circumstances that um, people have that allows them not to breastfeed and I, so I'm just so thankful that I can and that I'm able to. Um, 13. Do you plan to work or be a stay at home mom? I am a stay at home mom right now. Um, it would be really awesome if I could be a stay at home mom forever but um, unfortunately I don't think that is going to be the case. Um, my husband doesn't make enough money for us to, um, for me to stay at home. So I am looking for a job. <sighs> I just, I don't want to leave her. Um, but you have to do what's best for your babies. So, um, 14, will you make your own baby food? Just started. We just started solid. So, um, yes, I will be making my own baby food. Um, we're going to try baby uh, lead weaning um, along with um, just, you know, the, the purees. Um, and we're just going to see what one li she likes better. Huh. She, she's being a crazy girl. Um, Fifteen. Do you have nursery ideas or themes? We do have it. We we did have a theme. Um, but since she co-sleeps with us, um, we just, we... We took down her crib because it took up a lot of room, but it's actually, I have it right here because I made a little toy box out of her crib bumper. Um, it's like owls and birdies and flowers and there's butterflies. Um, that was pretty much her theme though, um, is we've got um, pink and purple butterflies. Um, was pretty much her nursery theme. So that is the pregnancy tag. Um, thank you guys for watching, and we'll talk to you later. Bye.